No real way to get there, no way to back up. So tight that you couldn't walk along the side of the ground, got ahead of you. You couldn't stand on the side and wait. But they backed it all the way up the sweep back down to about two miles. And, they, and 25 point turnarounds on that mountain top, and they done it with this truck. And uh, I can't say enough about these driving skills. Basically, hard work and common sense that these mechanics put to us to, uh, for the recovery. Uh, Hancock High School. Uh, I just graduated last year. We'll see. We'll see you back on, all right? We'll see you back on. Yes, ma'am, these are all from Mississippi. And I'll say these are mechanics or some of my mechanics. I'm from Guam. Anybody here? Well, I'll tell you what. If you did, uh, I don't know. What do you do for a living? No, I work in St. River. I'll probably bet you. Down in the South State Fire Marshal. Dorcas is picking for Furley. First one to jump in line, right? <laughs> <laughs> I'm a uh, county over Green County. Actually, I'm both of them actually. I'm glad I got it. Where are you going for? Sir, see the process. <laughs> no, it's, it's a caterpillar build on this one. Got a caterpillar edge and caterpillar transmission and Cushman uh, rear end. The earlier version was based on main. This, one, this is the uh, newer model. Some of them do. This is the A2. Uh, I don't know. He can tell you more, but I'll tell you this part. That is, the, that is a beast. Very much strong. You see, uh, it turns from torque. That don't sound like very much here. Very important to see you get out of this environment. I've seen it put the back tires off the ground, fall into a hole, back the two back wheels be off the ground, start sliding, put her in low range, and that truck will pull itself out. I mean, it's that, it's that strong, it's that powerful. That don't sound like very much, but it saves you from having to get out of this truck, and it saves you from having to do a recovery. Because that is, that is dangerous stuff, and it's not. Uh, it saves you, it's the, a boy's opportunity for a rollover. Mm -hmm. You can, when one wheel goes in, you can stop the truck, you can manhandle itself. I, I would say probably the muscle and the horsepower on these vehicles are probably one of our, other than the armor, that's a, that's our greatest friends to it. It's 84,000 pounds without the combat load. It's uh, 42 tons without the pro system, uh, your full combat load, with your ammo, personnel. This pro system that he just talked about, that's the weapon system that's mounted on top. It has optics, uh, thermal, uh, thermal vision got about 6,500 feet, uh, 6,500 meters. The gun that's on it, a little short, is a Mark 19. It's a 40 millimeter grenade, shoots belt fed machine gun, a belt fed 40 millimeter grenade. You're weak, it's about three more feet. Very, uh, very effective. Hey, Mom. Wait, 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 wait a second. Don't where you're from, tell me your name, where you're from. Okay, there you go. Hey, Staff Sergeant Management, Lightning, uh, Afghanistan. Hey, Mom, hey, Dad, from Mobile, Alabama, and this is Prince, Especially like these rural.
again. One, two, three. <laughs> two, three. All right, there you there go. You go. Get in there, my name is Staff Sergeant James Moat. I'm uh, stationed in uh, Gardez, Afghanistan. I'd like to tell my wife hello. One, two, I love her and my son Andrew. Hello and I love him. Where are you from? Blue State, Mississippi. There you go. Thanks. I'm Captain Marty Davis from Fob Lightning in Fob Lightning, Afghanistan. I want to say hello to my wife, Allison, and my four sons, Connor, Cannon, Colin, and Carson. Love y'all and miss y'all. Bye-bye. Wait, do it again. One more time. Do it one more time. Oh, you want to get Yeah, yeah. All right. Serious face. <laughs> you good side. All routes lead to Sam Z. Hey, sign up. Uh, let me know when you're ready. Hey, here. I'm good to go. Right, we got Staff Sergeant Mansfield from Five Lightning, Afghanistan. I want to say hello to my wife in Lacombe, Louisiana, my mother in uh, Mobile, Alabama, my father in Ocean Springs, Mississippi. 